What are my peoples and welcome to one of my videos here. In this video, I'm going to respond strictly to acting the headlines because I'm not going to sit back and watch this kind of disrespect coming from her mouth at all. I'm not going to do it no more. She's no different than the vision Christian Mario, Zachary K. Hubbard, and all these other idiots that think they know everything. Y'all don't know nothing that's going on in the hood at all. Okay? Now, before Hacking Hallens, before I get to you, I'm going to tell my subscribers, whoever else is watching this video, the reason why the Vision of Christian Mario channel has been shut down and the reason why he's being sued is because this man got videos talking about certain artists and entertainers in the industry, okay, on a disrespectful level. He's using his Christianity to use God's name in vain, obviously, to tell you that certain people in this industry are evil when he doesn't know nothing about them and they offended certain people that's watching the video, okay? Like that video he had on Lecrae, that was totally disrespectful. Lecrae is a Christian artist, okay? Lecrae goes to these venues, he goes to these athletes, stadiums, which I know a lot of y'all is accusing these athletes of being satanic, they really not. Lecrae, you know what I'm saying, will go to a basketball game inside a stadium with the words, for example, he'll pray for these people, he'll pray for these athletes like Steph Curry. Steph Curry really is a minister. Well, I'm going to say minister, he's a man of God, but Mark Jackson was a minister. You know what I'm saying? When he coached the uh, Golden State Warriors. So a lot of these um, basketball players, they believe in God. And Lecrae goes into these stadiums. He has Bible study. He prays for them. Okay? For Vision Christian Mario to be talking about Lecrae was really out of line. And see, all Vision Christian did was uh, piss off Lecrae's church. People from um, that he basically has ties with. People who are his friends and family. People who work with Lecrae. Okay? And even that video he has on Drake. See, I did a video on Vision Christian exposing him for talking about Drake's son. I told you, even if Drake has a child, he's still taking care of his kid. Drake is not doing nothing to take back this child at all. Vision Christian don't even have kids yet. He talking about another man's children. That's clearly out of line. All right? So this is why Vision Christian Mario's channel is no longer, okay? Y'all need to understand that that man is using his video for hate. Now, hacking the headlines, this is strictly for you. Yeah, you. I'm calling you out. Stop doing these videos. That video got on Cardi B is totally disrespectful. That's out of line, okay? You are not a real Christian at all. That's fake. Stop lying, okay? Matter of fact, headlines, you need to tell everybody who you really are. You're a white supremacist. You're a neo-Nazi. You come from the same people that voted Donald Trump in here. You believe you want to make America great again. Let's just be honest about it. You don't pick on none of these government officials at all, but you want to pick on someone like Cardi B. You got these officers that's your skin color that's killing my people, killing Mexican people, killing Samoans, killing angels right now, and you're not doing a single video on them at all. Why? Because you don't give a damn. You got other conspiracy theories like Alex Jones, okay? Zachary K. Albert, all these guys that's talking about Jews. They've been talking about Jews the last five years. Now you got somebody like Robert Bowles, who I just did a video on, just went into that synagogue, right? Before he even came in and he blinked and tell people, fuck your optics, I'm going in. Screw your optics, I'm going in, right? That man came in there with three weapons, three guns, automatic, semi-automatic weapons that's carrying 15, 20 rounds. And he unloaded on them people. That man killed 11 people who were Jews of the Jewish faith. Why? Because you got conspiracy videos like yours. Girl, you out of line. You need to stop this now. Stop this hate. Because I believe behind closed doors, hacking the headlines, you're calling people like Jay-Z and Beyonce niggers. You don't like us at all. Despite everything we have to go through and endure in this country. You see, Cardi B, she represents the people in this country who are the minority. They're the ethnicity, Right? They got to struggle and work hard more than so than your people. See, hacking the highlights, you don't come from the hood at all. You ain't grew up in New York like she did. She or nigga, and that's another thing too. Her and Nicki Minaj are not the same. Hacking the highlights, how you going to do a video about somebody doing hip hop you don't even listen to it at all? Don't get on on Bruno Mars. Don't say his song is trash. He got Cardi B on it. Cardi B, you got to be doing something right if Bruno Mars is working with her. You see, Bruno Mars don't work with everybody like that neither. That man is a top performed artist. Man that has hits for the last five years. Cardi B worked hard for her music. Now that woman blatantly telling you who the enemy was. She said the enemy was the government. The enemy is poisoning our food. They're screwing up with our water supply. And you're going to talk about it like the devil. Hacking the Hines, who the hell are you to tell, to tell you that... Who are you to say that she's the devil or what she's doing wrong? Honestly. You went through all that effort to try to find something against her. Why? Because Hacking Hines, just, uh, just be honest with you. You hate that woman. You jealous of the fact that she got all that money and she's a millionaire and she's able to provide for her family. That's what you hate, right? Because you can't do the same thing. Now you want to hate on her. Just, just a minute, Hacking Hamlet. It's a lot of you. And I know you and the vision Christian Mario together. 
Y'all like this. Y'all both talking about what you're going to do. You're going to set these videos and you want to get these subs, right? So you can do it for money. No hacking handlines. I'm calling you out now. You disrespectful. You need to take them videos down. Just like you talked about Kyrie Irving. That was really low down. Because Kyrie Irving don't want to believe in a flat earth. And this is another thing, too, that basically pissed me off with people like you hacking handlines. Y'all sit there and argue with people who don't agree with you about the earth being flat. If they think the earth is round, you think they're evil. They brainwash. That's really sickening, right? First of all, hacking handlines. Have you ever got in a plane, right, gotten on a spaceship with the NASA and actually seen if the Earth is really flat around? Okay? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Last time I checked, most of us ain't going to be able to leave out the universe at all. We're not going to be able to leave out the Earth. We're going to be able to leave out the Earth's atmosphere and go to where the uh, go to where the, uh, where the moon is. We're not going to be able to go out of there and go to where the stars are along. We ain't going to ever be able to find out if the Earth is flat or round. Now, shouts out to Daylight, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, uh, Third Eye, One Spot Only, you know what I'm saying, he was, like, Daylight even said this, specifically, right, he said, nobody's gonna ever be able to prove the Earth is really flat or round, so it really don't matter. You conspiracy theorists, man, y'all the line for this. Y'all are clearly not in reality at all. Y'all way of thinking is not how we think, okay? You see, Hacking Headlines, Cardi B comes from the hood like I have to come from the hood, alright? There are people like him who have to struggle every freaking day. Okay, you got some of these artists who ain't had both of their parents like you had. You see, I can't like you might have had both of your parents. They didn't. Okay, you cannot use your religion. <coughs> okay, you can't use your religion. Try to say you're a Christian, but use that for hate. Okay, you can't do that at all. All you're doing is spreading lies. That's why I have to clear that video up. Because hacking headlines, eventually you got to come out that house. You can't stay in your house forever. Okay. By you doing videos like that, like the video you got on Jay-Z and Beyonce, you know how other people may feel about that, right? But when you attack these artists, you're attacking these sponsors. You're attacking these record labels who's paying money and investing in these artists. See, these artists make money off of YouTube as well. And see, when you're making these type of videos, YouTube got to basically sensitize it because it could cause a lot of destruction. It could cause riots. It could cause hate. And see, hacking the headlines, you're wondering why your people are the most hated. Why my people ain't going to never forgive your people for what y'all did to us. That's not going to never happen. They're going to stay looking for a positive why because your people continue on to spread the hate. You continue to call us niggers. You continue to lynch our asses. Right in fact, right now, just recently, one of my friend's sons just got lynched. Okay? Just recently, in one of these southern states. Y'all, this is bad. Why them people lynched that brother? Because they were jealous of him. See, Hacking Hellhounds, I believe you do these videos because you don't like my people at all. You don't like the fact that how talented we are. You don't like the fact that we overachieve and we overcome all adversity ever thrown at us. That's why. Y'all need to stop picking at these, these hip-hop artists. They're not the enemy at all. Tell right now, nobody blatantly sacrifice their own family for the fame or fortune. That does not happen at all. And I'm a living proof of that. I, myself, am an Asian. I got artists I manage myself that are underground right now who are up and coming. Yeah, they got views, but they're not even big time like that. The reason why these artists get famous because they basically have to have hits. They have to work on their music for hours. They have to have a fan base. And people like their music so these labels can sign them. But no, nobody signs no contract in blood. Nobody sacrifices no goat, no lamb, or no human being. Okay? That's not how things work. That can handle is you're going to stop getting out this fake reality, this fake mindset. Okay? Carter B clearly told you who the enemy was. She says the government, right? So why are you putting the 666 on her Instagram live? You really have to know to go on Instagram live and actually record that shit. Or... You looked at somebody else's video that was hating on Cardi B and you did it from their video. Then you put your own little, uh, you added your own little symbols on there. Just like that peace sign. That peace sign was used to basically promote anti-war. Because the people who made that symbol was against war. It was against the fighting. A lot of these wars like the Vietnam War in the 1960s, where that peace sign came from. And in the 50s, there was against people going out of the war fighting along the Vietnamese. Innocent people died off that war. Okay? People had to go and fight that war without their, without their concern, right? They didn't have a choice to even, uh, if they want to choose to fight, they had to, or they're going to go to jail. Muhammad Ali went to jail because he wasn't about to fight a war that didn't concern him. He said, we have the war right now in this country. My people are being lynched. We've been arrested for no reason. We got people being killed. Dogs sent them. We, could, we didn't have the right to even vote back then. Yet you continue to say we're puppets, right? Why we got to be puppets? No, Hacking Handlines, you, you got this all wrong. You need to stop listening to your family. Spread that hate. Stop listening to whoever your preacher is. They are wrong. They are line. Yeah, Hacking Handlines, I'm calling you out personally. I want, I want you to look at my video now. Look at my eyes. Hacking Handlines, you. I'm going to have your channel shut down. You need to be shut down like Division Christian.
Y'all are out of line. Y'all spreading lies. Stop lying to these people, hacking the allies. Won't you tell these people what your root true attention is? You're only doing this for money. Because these elites you're talking about, you're not going to stop them. All right? The elites, these so-called elites you talk about got money you will never, ever make in your lifetime. You will never get close to them, to them at all. You never breathe the same air they breathe, yet alone even get near them. So what's the point? But no, hacking the headlines, we are not your enemy. These artists and entertainers, athletes, they are my skin color, not the enemy. We never was. Okay? How are we going to be working for an evil organization when our people weren't even, you know saying, had fair trial? We can't get a fair trial. My people can be accused of rape and we still go to jail. Okay? Yeah, how are we the enemy? And look at everything that's been going on to us the last 40 years. Just 40, 50 years ago, we had dogs sick on us, right? Rosa Parks, you know what I'm saying, was being pressed because she wouldn't sit in the back of the bus. She wanted to sit in the front of the bus. She wouldn't, she wouldn't give up her front seat. Just 50 years ago, Martin Luther King died because he said, I had a dream. Just 50 years ago, back in the 60s, JLK got killed. Why? Because he was talking about the government. He's talking about the people that's basically been endorsing these false, these lies, endorsing these messed up laws. Just 50 years ago, we were segregated, right? There are color-only, color white-only restrooms and bathrooms, white-only theaters. See, Hacking the Handlines, let me explain something to you right now. You want to know what the 666 is? It's six protons, six neutrons, right? The other six is for the, this melanin right here. That's where it comes from. Won't you admit it? Yo, won't you, Hacking the Handlines, won't you admit it that your people stole a lot of our ideas from Africa? See, Hacking the Handlines, I know stuff that you ain't going to never talk about. You ain't going to talk about where a lot of this music stuff come from. You're not going to study Africa at all. You ain't going to study them pyramids. Why? Because you've been brainwashed. You and your skin color have been led to believe that my people are inferior because your people think of us as the devil. Back in headlines, just admit it. Get out and just tell people right now how you really feel. That your family thinks of people like Cardi B as niggers. Behind closed doors, y'all call these artists white niggers, yellow niggers, brown niggers. Okay? Not just black niggers. You call them red niggers, you call them all kinds of niggers. Yeah, of course you go think Cardi B's videos is trash, your music is trash. Why? Because you don't listen to it. No, Cardi B had to work hard. Yeah, she'd been in strip clubs, but she had to do what she had to do to make it. That man had that woman had family to feed. Okay, she gotta pay her bills like everybody else. This is why I can't stand about people like you. Y'all got it twisted. Okay? And that's not real Christianity at all. It's not. Jesus did not blatantly tell you to go on a video and start lying on somebody you don't even know. You don't know where this woman came from at all, yet you're talking about her like she trash, like she evil. And see, hacking the headlines, this is the problem, right? Your type of video spread poison. It spreads lies. Okay? It's not helping nobody, but making other people want to hate these people more to, to the fact they want to kill them. And it's sad. You got people really obsessed with sacrifice. Like, these people want these artists to kill somebody else. They want, it, they want them to be killed. It's sad. To even say that about another human being says a lot about you as an individual. But see, hacking the headlines, you can't hide in, there, in your house forever. I bet you got to you got to uh you have to come out that computer screen. I bet you got to come out there. You got to come out there and go shopping. I bet you you got to come out that house, okay? And I can handle this. I'm only telling this as a warning. Take those videos down. You pissing off certain people that you don't want to piss off at all. And Cardi B is not the woman you want to be doing videos about at all. And you being white makes this much worse. And see, Cardi B, I'm not racist like that. I'm not like you at all. If you look on all all every last one of my videos, my videos are not blatantly targeting. Certain artists, right? I don't target Justin Timberlake. I don't target Britney Spears, okay? I don't target Tom Hanks. I don't target Tom Cruise or Angelina Jolie. I don't just look for symbolism like that, all right? Because I know that's nothing but a bunch of crap. And I know it's your people that went them to Africa, right? Years ago, right? And they learned our secrets. They learned our culture. The symbol was like this one eye, the pyramid, this, this, this is an okay symbol. It was not the 66 at all, Okay? No, your people created that stupid conspiracy theory. Hacking headlines because your people are not in reality at all. Y'all want to blame these elites. You want to blame other people for your own mistakes. Okay? Or is it that y'all just special ed? Y'all get a crazy check. You on SSI. Y'all mentally retarded. Something's wrong there. That's not reality at all. See, hacking headlines reality is if you got talent, you got a usual talent. People got to work every day. They got jobs they got to do. If they got talent, they going to use it. They got a dream. They're not going to let people like you stop them. No hacking highlights. Cardi B ain't the enemy at all. That woman's Dominican Republican. And if she don't even want her own parents living in this country, then what does this tell you? 
Hacking headlines. We live in a uh, screwed up America. Oh, this this country we live in is totally screwed up at all. It's messed up. Like Cardi B told you, the food is bad. The water is bad. Okay? Look at what's been going on with my people, right? We still being killed innocently. We still being lynched. Okay? And speaking of slavery, just out there in Lebanon, and, and the Lebanese right now in this near Egypt is getting sold for slavery right now as we speak for $400 a slave. That's going on right now in these other countries. There are people being enslaved. Honduras, right? The reason why the people are trying to escape the country, right? Because it's bad over there. Honduras been bought off by the uh by the been bought off by them drug dealers, okay? Them drug them Colombian drug dealers and bought that country completely off and it's corrupting it. So them people are trying to escape and come to America. Why do they want to they don't want to be around that? These Jews, right, that you hate that you people hate. Y'all do so much video on the Jews, right? But last time I checked, these Jews was just minding their own business. These Jews just had their own community. These Jews wasn't coming at nobody. These Jews ain't the one wearing sheets over their eyes, covering themselves up while they getting the gun and start shooting and killing. These Jews ain't burning down crosses like your people been doing. So why are they the enemy? And what's crazy, right, we fought against Adolf Hitler in World War II just so, just so we could stop that. But how can handle your people basically adopted that same type of hatred? Why? Because your people got jealousy and hatred in your own heart. Y'all are still pissed off that your people lost in the war in the South. The South lost the war. You can't own slaves no more so you can continue this damn hatred. Get out your freaking feelings already. Just stop, Hacking Headlines. Yeah, I hope you see this video right now. And of course, you're not going to respond to me, Hacking Headlines, at all. You're really not because you're that much of a coward. You're that, you're that, you don't want to face me at all. Hacking Headlines, I speak for everybody you don't talk about innocently. Jay-Z and Beyonce, I'm sorry, they're not the enemy. Jay-Z came out Mossy. He came with the projects in Mossy in Brooklyn, New York. You know how rough that is? There are people, young men, that don't want to live to be 21, where Jay-Z comes from, okay? See, Hacking Highlands, you come in a different neighborhood. You wasn't raised in a ghetto like these people were. You wasn't raised in a neighborhood that had a, that was full of gang violence. Men and women wearing rags and stuff. You, you wasn't growing up in a neighborhood where you had drive-by shootings often. You wasn't raised in a neighborhood where people were getting killed innocently. You wasn't raised in a neighborhood where you had blacks have to fight Italians because the same racism you don't even spreading. You don't come from a neighborhood at all where people have to struggle. People barely have enough food to eat. Barely have enough to feed their own children. Kids got to walk out of here with barely no shoes to wear. No clean clothes. Hack and handles, what you going to do? Let's say your, your rent is due and you don't have enough to even pay it. And you about to get evicted from your home. What you going to do when your gas and electricity about to get cut off? Because you barely struggling to even take care of yourself. These men... You know what I'm saying? Impregnating these 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 um these women, these women gotta raise children on their own. Because the men gotta work hard because ain't no jobs being brought into the hood. Liquor stores being flooded, gunshots being flooded by gentrification. Hacking headlines, you don't understand that at all. And that's where a lot of these artists come from. They come from that type of reality. So you conspiracy theorists, y'all gotta basically stop it now. Stop putting the devil on my people. We are not worshiping the devil at all. We didn't create the devil. Your people did hacking headlines. Like y'all created this 666. That market beast came from your people basically rewriting the Bible. Y'all went to ancient Egypt, okay? The Portuguese, these Europeans that come out of Rome, they settled into the country in Africa, went into the pyramids and started taking from those walls. And y'all created this devil. Y'all created Jesus. I told you, back in the back in the um, in the early 14th, 13th century BC, they wasn't even saying the word Jesus. They was calling him Yahshua or Yashin. Yeah, you wonder why you got the nation is on that don't like y'all. They call y'all pigs. They call y'all peckerwoods. Why? Because y'all be y'all continue to call us niggers. You call us colored. Y'all still don't respect us at all. And how can I realize this is why the, the hate in this country gonna continue on? But I'm gonna fight you. You need to be checked for that. How can I realize somebody needs to sit down with you? Okay? Either your like, like somebody that's not that don't have the same type of mindset. Either your boss, a counselor, somebody needs to sit down with you and tell you. What's really going on? They need to remind you that we're not the enemy at all. Okay, we not. Yeah. I'm not saying there may not be no corruption in this record industry or in the entertainment industry because it is. You, you, got, you got a lot of these, these perverts, right? But everybody ain't on the same agenda. Everybody don't got that evil mindset. Everybody's not worshiping the devil. They not. They damn sure ain't Freemasons at all. Okay? Like, like, you got the nerve to call Kyrie Irving a Freemason? How Kyrie Irving going to be a Freemason when he's been playing basketball his whole life? Free, Kyrie Irving don't got time to be no Freemason. To be a Freemason means you got to want to be a Freemason. Then they got to have a background check ran on you. 
Everybody not gonna become a Freemason. They ain't got that kind of time. They ain't got that kind of money. I'm sorry. That's not how it works. I've been to a lodge already. You haven't. Okay? That dollar on the pyramid, that py yeah, that, that one on the pyramid, on the dollar, that's not even evil. My black people, you know what I'm saying? My ancestors built them pyramids that your people stole. Okay? How can handle this bad things to talk about than going on somebody's, going on a Grammy's, going recording a Grammy performance, trying to expose a certain artist and looking for symbolism all day? Like the videos you got of um, Princess, Prince, trying to say Prince and Mac Miller faked his death. How the hell is somebody going to fake their death? Nobody got time for that shit. The artists formerly known as Prince, Temptation and Mac Miller are dead. They're gone. They're never coming back. Temptation was really murdered. Hack in the headlines, he really was. You don't believe me? Go look back at those videos. Go on the internet right now and go look at that. Go look at the autopsy. All right? Temptation had enemies, okay? That wanted to kill him just because. Rolled up on him and shot him. Put it down. Killed him. Right there, you know what I'm saying? At that motorcycle shop, okay? Mac Miller OD. Yes, there's a such thing as OD and off of drugs. The reason why Ariana Grande left him because he wouldn't leave drugs alone. Okay? That man been doing drugs since before he got into the industry. Alright? That man was drinking lean, okay? That got perk that got uh, all types of coding in there. Alright? Over the over the counter prescription drugs, you're not supposed to be taking unless your doctor prescribed for you. Okay? I hang your hands, I don't understand what you what you're about, but you need to stop. Try to do this for money, you're evil. I can handle just, just face it. You think of us as niggers. Come on now. Be real. You're a Satanist. Be real. You're a white supremacy. Just be honest, Hacking Headlines. One of these one of these people from these racist organizations paying you right now to do these videos. Like they paid Vincent Chris Mario. He had to learn the hard way what it is. Hack the headlines you next. I'll tell you that now. Because Cardi B look at this video. What you gonna do if Cardi B right now, you know what I'm saying, pays money, pays one of her lawyers or agent, okay? Somebody from labor, look up your address, look where you live at. And then she takes a trip to go to your household. She's knocking at your door. You come to the door. You see Cardi B standing right in front of it. What you going to do then? Hmm? You going to slam the door in her face? What you going to do is she catch you and she roll up on you. And she wants to whip your ass. You going to run and hide? You going to cower out? Because heck of a headline. Let's be honest right now. Like like for like even Kendrick Lamar, right? And Kendrick Lamar has said it numerous times that he worships God. He believes in God. That man don't worship the devil at all. His whole, and then I went out to Pippa Butterfly, it's based on him talking against the devil. That song Lucy was talking against, talking to tell you who the devil is. Okay? Go look at that song Lucy. Alright? By Kid Lamar. You want to expose his, his video? Why? Why? Kid Lamar has even said it, man. I'll never get his speech when he first won his award, right? He said, I was the same boy, the same man, man, used to see at the GR Men, Jim Relief, right? Struggling. Until I came up with a dream, I came up with a goal, and I basically accomplished it. It was nobody like God, but that helped me. So how's that man evil? That's what I'm still trying to figure out, right? You think if these artists be the same time, they really not. No. Hacking headlines, leave these entertainers, leave these athletes, leave these celebrities alone. Because we're not going to take it no more. And Hacking headlines, all your videos doing is spreading hate, right? You instigating a riot. You instigating another mass murder. Okay? Just like Alex Jones kept pushing for the Jews, saying Jews are evil. Jews is this, Jews is that. That dude, that that man Robert Battles really came in there and started killing him because he think they were evil, right? They they get they coming in here to kill us. I don't want a hip hop concert that Cardi B, Beyonce, Jay Z, Kid Lamar are performing in and it gets shot up. Cause somebody gonna decide to go in into the like the like the Las Vegas shooter, right? He came up in there and started spraying and shooting. Had a machine gun, had a goddamn M16 and started hitting shooting at them people. People really died from that. I don't want a hip hop concert. They're performing to be shot at and bombed because of your videos. Hack and headlines, I need to stop now. Okay, so yeah, I'm calling y'all personally. I don't care no more. Alright? I had to do a video basically exposing that Cardi B video and exposing that Kyrie Irving video to get you to stop. Because you're wrong, you out of line. Okay? Just like some of your subs. Because Cardi, because you gotta stand. Hack and headlines, you, you are Asian of chaos. All right, you are wolf in sheep clothing. You are the problem with religion. Period. Okay, you take it too far, and I'm not gonna have it no more. There's other people that ain't gonna have it no more. We tired. Okay, we're tired. Leave us alone. How can handle these people? Ain't gonna do nothing to you at all. They're not. They're just people with talent trying to make it in this country.
Have some compassion. Have some heart. Just like you talked about Prince's mother, Roger Nelson's sister like that. That woman is 60-something years old. Prince passed away two years ago in 2016. Everybody grieves differently. To put on blast like that was clearly out of line. You're wrong for that. You see, hacking line lines, God ain't going to save you if they want to put a lawsuit against you. God ain't going to save you if the YouTube shuts down all your channels. And it just tells you better to make another channel. Don't do it no more. Hacking headlines don't. Okay? So just as visually Christian Mario got his channel shut down, you next. I warn you, Hacking Headlines. Take those take Cardi's B's video now. Take Kidra Lamar's video down. Take Cardi. Yeah, take all that. Take all that down. Beyonce and Jay-Z, take all that down. Any rapper you got on there, any athlete you got on there, take that down. Because you about to start something you can't finish. Okay? And I don't want to see nobody get hurt. I don't wish harm on nobody, but this has to stop. You are not a Christian at all. Spreading that kind of hate. You're not. And that goes for anybody else doing these videos. Try to talk about somebody getting sacrificed. Just stop. Ain't nobody going to sacrifice their own mom or their daddy for fame or fortune. Nobody's that stupid. They, they're not dumb at all. They don't have to. Okay? I'm tired of this foolishness. Alright? We are not the devil. Okay? My people are, you know what I'm saying? These artists ain't saying tag no more. This can't happen no more, alright? And I don't care how your subs feel about me. That's the truth. Okay? That peace symbol is not an upside down crucifix at all. Because, how can the hell eyes? The reason why a lot of the government didn't like that peace symbol, they hated hippies because those people, the, the Caucasians that was ready, that peace symbol was basically helping my people out. They had a heart for my people. Okay? Like I said, it was against war. They were against killing innocent people. That's why that peace symbol is around. It ain't got nothing to do with the devil at all or being evil. No, you made that up. Just be honest. Like that book you was trying to read that page from, where did it really come from? You don't know, do you? Okay? So how you go break that up? You see, lies. Stop telling lies. Most of your videos is nothing but a bunch of lies and bull crap. And I'm not going to, I'm not going to say, I, this is why I'm calling you out now. Okay? And I'm only doing this because I don't want nothing bad to happen to you. But videos on Cardi B right now, oh no, you, you bury Carver too. You, what you wish, you basically, you basically instigate somebody to come after you. I'll tell you that now. You need to stop. That's the wrong woman to talk about. Even Jay-Z Beyonce, you don't want to be talking about them like that at all. Because them two, those two, you know what I'm saying, basically have to work hard and they have to grind their whole life to make it. No, man, they not, they not on this evil stuff no more. Matter of fact, Jay-Z's last album, 444, what you need to listen to was educating people. They'll tell you about what it is. He was telling you about the story of OJ. All right. He was telling you about a whole lot of stuff. You no, know, and Beyonce is a mother of two. Okay? She's not an evil woman at all. And, and that's another thing, Hacker Highlands. I'm going to do this before I go. You got to understand that. People that have my skin color got to work this much harder than your people. Okay? But no, you're not a real Christian at all. Just stop. Okay? Just stop doing this nonsense. Okay, if you're going to be racist, be racist. Be who you are, if that's who you really are. If not, stop spreading lies. Stop spreading hatred. Because all that stuff about these artists, you break it up, it's all lies. It's all wrong. And for anybody watching this video, if you want to find out what's really going on, go visit Atlantic Records. Go up to Universal. Go up to, take a field trip to these record stations, these record labels, and talk to them yourselves. Go try to talk to these artists. Go look at these interviews, okay? You come to find out, a lot of these artists are really intelligent. They really smart. Okay? A lot of them got stories of how they really made it. Ain't none of this ain't telling this devil stuff went on at all. None. Anyways, folks, that's the video. You know what I'm saying? Shouts out to my subs. Y'all stay blessed. Stay tuned. I'll, I'll see you soon. But no. Hacking Highlands, this got to stop. Okay? You, you, you out of line for this. We just recently got had somebody, had a group of, a, a group of people, you know what I'm saying, who were just buying their own business. You know what I'm saying? Basically, worshiping their religion, being respectful, okay? Not, not bothering the soul, not bothering nobody has just been shot up because you got somebody that's literally been led to believe that those particular people were evil, okay? I'm tired of seeing mass murderers. I really am. And I don't want my people to be targeted next anyway. either way. Because even then, like I told you, man, Robert Byers is no different than Dale Roof. Matter of fact, Hacking Hanlon's, where was your video on Dale Roof shooting up the black folks in that church, in a Christian church? I don't see no I don't see I don't see never one of those videos at all. Okay? The Santa Fe, Texas high school shooter, you don't got no videos on none of these other mass murderers at all. None.
And we had already four of them in the last, in just this year alone. I don't see you doing videos on slavery, okay? People be enslaved overseas, none of that, none of those videos at all. But yet, you got the nerve to talk about somebody like Cardi B? No, you wrong for that. Down the line. Peace out.